Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, and we are glad to be back. It's been a minute. Uh, we're back on track, though. And another daily devotion, the word for you today. If you haven't already done so, please make sure you click on that subscribe button. We thank you for your support, and let's get started. So today's devotion is titled, A Heart Filled with Goodness. Scripture is Luke 6 and 45. A good man brings good things out of the good stored up in his heart. Where does goodness come from and how can you cultivate more of it in your daily decisions and actions? Some people think goodness is a matter of the head and that right thinking results in right living. Today, every politician gives the impression that education is the panacea, panacea, hmm, tomato, tomato, for practically every problem in society, yet education of the head without the same emphasis on integrity of the heart will produce only clever fiends. Okay. If education alone were the answer, white collar crimes would likely drop. Others think goodness is a matter of the hands. They say goodness means treating people well, but doing good does not make a person good. Ooh, say that again. Doing good does not make a person good. Murderers on death row may be good to their mothers, but they are not good individuals. The truth is, goodness is not located in the head or the hands. It's hidden in your heart. Jesus, the best man who ever lived, said, a good man brings good things out of the good stored up in his heart. Goodness is not merely a matter of what we know or what we do. It is a matter of what we are. Ooh, I like that. As you consider the life ahead of you, what really matters is not how long you live, but how well you lived. Sir Francis Bacon once said, of all virtues and dignities of the mind, goodness is the greatest being the character of deity and without it, man is a busy, mischievous, wretched thing. <laughs> so in your desire to be good, draw closer to God. After all, you become like the company you keep. That is true. Check your crew. <laughs> so there you have it. A heart filled with goodness and a day filled with scripture. So have a great, great day and we will see you tomorrow.